Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steeler Nation what's on our minds. I'm Melanie Friedlander. Two days ago, free agent running back David Johnson left his visit with the New Orleans Saints without signing a contract. Based on his tweet that they unfortunately couldn't come to terms, it seems it had more to do with the length and value of the deal that was offered than his level of fitness. Steelers fans immediately tweeted that he should instead come to Pittsburgh, and Johnson responded enthusiastically that it would be a great place to be. Johnson could easily take over as RB2, providing reliable depth much in the way D'Angelo Williams did behind Le'Veon Bell several years ago, as Dave Bryan pointed out on SteelersDepot.com. If the new GM, Omar Khan, can find a way to sign Johnson, the running back room would be set. But if the Saints couldn't make it happen, it's not likely that the Steelers will either. And that still leaves a question mark on the running back depth chart. While Benny Snell Jr. is a valuable contributor on special teams, he isn't exactly the answer to who can back up starter Najee Harris. Looking at the current list of free agents, there are a few options. The name that stands out to me is Devonta Freeman. The former fourth-round draft pick out of the Atlanta Falcons in 2014 is a two-time Pro Bowl selection and led the league in rushing touchdowns in 2015, when he was also a second-team All-Pro. After six years in Atlanta, Freeman was signed by the Giants and had an underwhelming year with a team that went 6-10 and behind an offensive line that was ranked 31st in the league. Signed by the Ravens last season following injuries to virtually every running back on their roster, Freeman started eight games and played in 16, posting respectable rushing and receiving numbers. Competing with his own quarterback, Lamar Jackson, who rushed for 767 yards, Freeman still logged 133 carries for 576 yards, averaging 4.3 yards per attempt. He also caught 34 passes for 190 yards with a catch percent of 80%. If there's a knock on Freeman, it's his work in blitz pickup. PFF gave him a pass blocking grade of 52.8 last year. Then again, it's a heck of a lot better than David Johnson, who graded out with a 34.4 or even Benny Snell, with a pass-blocking grade of 49. While Freeman is 30 years old and has missed some time due to injury in the past, he finished last season strong and in good shape. Baltimore was able to sign him to a one-year deal in 2021 for just over $1 million. While the Steelers don't seem to be in any rush to sign another player to the running back room, Devonta Freeman may be a welcome addition, much as D. Will was seven years ago. That's my take. You can follow me on Twitter at Girl Surgeon. Check out The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Follow us on SteelersDebo.com and check out The Terrible Podcast with Dave Bryan and Alex Kazora every Tuesday and Friday.